Um, my name is Do Not Obey, and let's get started. What's up guys it's me do not obey and welcome back to another video now i just want to do this short quick little video um i've seen this clip going around and a lot of people are you know kind of you know making fun or whatnot but i'm open-minded you guys know this and i do have a belief in reptilians now i'm not saying this story is true i don't know okay i just want to put this video out here and kind of get you guys' opinion on it um, just because, you know, she's a preacher, you know, there's, I'm not saying there's no sympathy for, you know, I'm, that's not even where I'm trying to go with it. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. The point is, it intrigued my mind. Um, I can possibly say that this allegedly could be true. I mean, why could, why wouldn't it be? You know what I mean? But what do you guys think about it? Um, I did throw in a clip, but the source is in here so you guys can watch the full video. Um, I know the young turks also talked about it so you know just let me know what you guys think and like i always say guys do not obey stay woke peace this other derek appears in our bed the real derek is lying down next to me other derek sits right up out of it it startled me I knew that was not Derek, and so I asked this critter, who are you? Because he clearly wanted to have sexual relations. I said, he said, come on, I'm your husband. I said, who are you? And he had the nerve to claim to be Ahasuerus, Xerxes. Well, other Derek seriously wanted to invite me to use my free will to do something that was going to pull me away from God. So this last time, I knew he was really desperate. And I asked him again, who are you? He told me the same answer. And I finally I said, I've had enough in my mind. I reached up. I grabbed his face. And I said, you are a liar. And I pulled that face off, and beneath it was a reptile. 